Well, to health matters, open heart surgeries have been most uh, su unsuccessful in most Nigerian hospitals due to complexities and also cost. The Federal Medical Center has now taken up the challenge to go on this journey in order to alleviate a part of Nigeria's medical tourism challenges. Kemi Balogun has more on this. Africa was certified polio-free in August 2020 after Nigeria became the last African country to eliminate the virus. But a new case was recently detected in Malawi. There are concerns that this new case, which was detected through a quality surveillance system in Malawi, could also slip into Nigeria. I was not worried about the possibility of that slipping back into our country while we also are battling with cases of circulation vaccine-derived virus, which I'm told is now called circulating variant of polio virus. In the midst of this gloomy news, there is still a reason to celebrate the grand feat achieved by some Nigerian physicians around the world. In this case, it is to celebrate the election of a Nigerian physician into the World Medical Association as president. As an attestation, this is another milestone of a focused and determined medical practitioner who has recorded, recorded many firsts in the medical profession, not only in Nigeria, but also in the Commonwealth of Nations. Nigeria will, through this elevation, clearly champion the ideals of the World Medical Association, especially the advocates, the advocacy of... 